Good morning everybody, Low Wolf Rick here. It is a Thursday morning here in Las Vegas, about 11 a.m. Here on this windy, windy day. Current temperature is 73 degrees. It's uh, looking at a high of 81. This is a day that the uh, weather service is calling a red flag day. And what a red flag day is here is the, uh, when it's super dry conditions, super windy conditions because the wind's supposed to peak up to about 40 to 50 mile per hour today and super dry uh, so those three things add to uh, uh, possibility of a uh, fire and this is here not only in the las vegas area but throughout arizona and uh, so everywhere where it's dry and it's so dry and super windy so uh, we'll keep an eye out for that hopefully uh, nothing bad happens but uh, uh, you just never know Scary times, scary times, it's especially as dry as it is here in the uh, this region. Uh, other than that, let's talk about uh, a couple of things here that we got today on our blog. Uh, we're going to talk about what's coming up this weekend here. Uh, Friday or Saturday nights, it's like uh, some of the concerts or events that's going on. We have uh, Friday night at the Golden Nugget. We have Herman's Hermits. 1960s group uh, making an appearance at the Golden Nugget. We have Friday and Saturday night at the West Gate, Barry Manilow and his residency there. Friday night at the Cosmopolitan, we have Deftones. They'll be performing at the Cosmo at the uh, Friday night. John Legend starts his, uh, or continues his uh, residency. He will be at Planet Hollywood on Friday and Saturday night. Saturday night at T-Mobile Arena, the weekend will be there if you want to check that out. Uh, I know tickets are still available for that. And Saturday night the Mandalay, at Mandalay Bay Beach, uh, they start their beach concert series. We've got uh, Walker Hayes, country music star Walker Hayes will be at the, uh, at the beach at Mandalay Bay. Check him out. And uh, I just want to let everybody know also, it's like the thing, it's like the... Uh, uh, mask mandate here in Nevada for all public transportations has been lifted. Uh, no more mask mandates for uh, that's at the airport. Uh, that is all like uh, public transportation, taxi cabs, uh, the bus, uh, RTC buses, uh, the Las Vegas monorail, uh, Uber and Lyft. Uh, there are no uh, no mask mandates anymore for those areas. However, it's like I did want to add, it's like the thing, Uber and Lyft drivers do have the rights uh, to require, and taxi drivers too, do have the rights to require a, a customer to wear a mask if they so deem. Uh, so if you have, a, you might want to carry one with you still. Uh, but uh, as far as the uh, regulations, it's like as far as the state and the Las Vegas area, uh, there is no more uh, mask mandates uh, for uh, any of the public areas or the airports. Uh, uh, anymore so uh, just so everybody has is aware of that and uh, one last thing I wanted to talk about also is like uh, you know I always talk about the room rates and how expensive the room rates are getting here in the Las Vegas area and uh, I found a site that uh, uh, talks about this like what the room rates have increased from uh, per month from last year to this year so we have the, the first three months of January, February, and March of last year versus January, February, and March of this year. It shows it's like what the uh, uh, rates have gone up. We've got the January of uh, last year versus this year. This year is up 87% over January of last year. Uh, February last year versus this year. This year is up 77%. And March in last year versus this year uh, is up seven, was up 74% uh, year to date numbers. It's like from last year to this year. And uh, I know a lot of it has to do with, uh, uh, now these are just the rates. These don't include the uh, resort fees and stuff. So I know a lot of it's on the weekends. Uh, the weekend rates, it's like are, they're climbing uh, basically through the roof here. But people are paying them. It's like uh, the occupancy is like uh, the weekends is in the high 80% range. And uh, it's interesting. It's like that people are actually paying the rates. It's like the thing. It's like, you know, all we keep reading and, or hearing, it's like in the media is recessions, family struggling. 
and uh, but when it comes to Las Vegas, uh, uh, the rates are climbing, uh, food prices are climbing, and people are paying the prices. So uh, it's very interesting uh, times. Um, other than that, it's like I'm standing, it's like it's super windy outside. It's like right now, it's like uh, the wind was blowing about 30 to 40 miles per hour. And I stopped a couple of places, it's like I was going to do my vlog, and it's like the wind was just crazy busy. So I stopped inside the uh, M&M store, and I'm on the upper level here at the M&M store. I did a video from here uh, just a few days ago. Check it out if you would, I'd greatly appreciate it. And uh, But uh, yeah, so it's uh, no wind in here. Everything's very cool. People are downstairs shopping. Gotta love it. I am Lone Wolf Rick. Thank you very much for joining me. I greatly appreciate every one of you. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. I greatly appreciate that. Hit the notification bell. I'll let you know whenever uh, we post a video here. And uh, for all of my subscribers and everybody watching their videos, thank you very, very much. I greatly appreciate every one of you. All right, everybody. Thank you very much. Uh, that's my vlog for today. Uh, hopefully there was some useful information for you. Everybody take care, okay? And stay healthy. And uh, we'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye, everybody.